Bacon Wonderland out there. I applied for Social Security Disability Benefits. Can someone please make this easy for me? We take care of all the paperwork, so all you have to do is wait for those checks to start coming in. Now I'm approved and getting my checks. It's just that easy. How well does your doctor listen? I just know she wasn't hearing me. More patients say they think their doctors ignore their concerns. The five things you need to do if your doctor isn't listening. Thursday at 4 on Local 3 News. Local Sky 3, bringing you the big local news from unique views. I hope you're hungry as you watch this morning because you are going to be by the time this next interview is over. Can you tell we're not in the studio? Guess where we are? Back out at Don's Meat Shop in Hickson, just in time for all your Christmas fun purchasing. Food-wise, that is. Yep. Good to see you, Don Rains. Good to see you, Julie. So uh, Santa Claus ain't got nothing on you, right? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when it comes to this season, the next couple of weeks, I mean, gosh, Don, you're going to pack a punch between Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, and then New Year's right around the corner. Sure. You've got something for everybody. I do. You've got some personal fan favorites, though. People have been coming to you for a lot of years. Oh, yeah. So you've kind of curated the literal market right. for the figurative market out there. Uh huh. People like your standing rib roast. Oh, yeah. We sell a ton of them. And, you know, it's a wonderful Christmas meal. Mm -hmm. It's kind of one of those awe moments. Right. Um, for like Bananas Foster, you know, that you yeah. just, it's a visual memory. Sure. That you have. So do you help people know how to prepare it, Don? Absolutely. Have we, have, we have some instructions. We have thermometers to help you because temperature is very important. Mm -hmm. Are they a one size, a standing rib roast, or can you buy different sizes? Oh, no. We do anywhere from two ribs to seven ribs can be anywhere from say six pounds to 20 pounds okay so we'll we'll help you size it well, the quality of the meats that you get here is different than when what than what you find oh, other yeah. places so i'm guessing you encourage your customers to be a little bit careful in over um seasoning the meats because you want it to complement but not take away right oh yeah you don't want to over season you definitely don't want to overcook right mm -hmm. okay what's another fan favorite this time of year oh wow Christmas? Well, you know, Christmas, you're you're doing standing rib roast, bone in, boneless. You're doing whole tenderloins, whole beef mm -hmm. tenderloins, fillets. We'll get orders for for some people just to serve fillets, seafood like lobster tails, yep. scallops, crab legs. You're doing a lot with crab legs now, aren't you? Didn't you say? Yeah. That? Oh yeah, and um, you know. We have sea bass, and we have just a ton of shrimp, mm -hmm. different shrimp, some wild-caught Gulf shrimp, wild-caught Argentine reds. So we have a lot to pick from. You have really, really tapped into then kind of the culinary fun yeah. that we have here in town now. It used to be that Christmas Day was just ham and potato salad, but not anymore. Oh, no. A lot of beef. A lot of beef. A lot of beef. Also, Christmas yeah. morning is a big one. I know at our house, you sure. open presents for a little bit, then you take a break and have a nice big breakfast. Mm -hmm. You've got some great ideas there. Oh, yeah. we got, you know, country ham, sausages, you know, link sausages. So you got a lot of stuff. If people come to you now and buy Christmas presents, my mom has a habit of giving mm -hmm. my brother, somehow I get left out, right. a, a box of steaks. Um, for, for Christmas. Sure. And if you buy now and put them in the freezer, will they still be good? Oh, sure. We'll vacuum seal them for you, which okay. will help prevent freezer burn. They'll okay. they'll, they'll last a year in, in a vacuum really? seal. Really? That sure. long? Yeah. So if you come in and you purchase something, maybe you do want to get something that you're going to go ahead and cook on Christmas Eve, right. but you want to get two, will y'all vacuum seal something Ab for people? Absolutely. We do it all the time. Okay. The lobster, I know you're always real proud of the lobster you carry. Sure. Where is it from? Canada. It's uh, Atlantic cold water lobster. Okay. You know, uh, so it's going to have a, a, a nice texture and a sweetness to it. So it's really good. When I came in, I'm not going to make you quote prices because your prices fluctuate. Some. Right. But I noticed when I came in today, there's kind of a freezer over here to my left, and there was a bit of a sale going on over there, so I peeked. Yeah. Grocery store prices continue to be an issue for people. You've managed to really keep yours fair. I try. I mean, you know, some of the markets are against us right now. Mm -hmm. But, you know, we do our best to make it tolerable, you right. know. And you're, and you're looking at stuff, you know, if we can pass a deal on, we do. The we is not just on. This is a family-owned <laughs> business. 
So uh, we're here uh, with our production manager, Doug, yeah. and they began talking off camera a minute ago because Doug used to shop when your dad had the store. Sure. And now he comes to you and then your son's in the bullpen right. uh, doing it as well. That means a lot, I think, for your customers. Absolutely. You know, it's, they have a peace of mind in knowing that we're going to be around for a long time. Yep. Um, when it comes to gift ideas, too, for the men in your life, maybe the women, yeah. I'm kind of eyeing some ideas for just fun things to bring <laughs> as hostess gifts, maybe, sure. uh, or to wrap up and give to the men in your life. You've got great rubs and uh, spices and seasonings. Yep, and we'll be all stocked up. We're, we'll have it all. And gift cards. Absolutely. You know, gift cards always a great way to go if you're not sure exactly what to get. Okay, Christmas Eve this year falls on a Sunday. It does. So are you open? Absolutely. Okay. We'll be open to 4 p.m. on Christmas Eve on Sunday. Okay. Then we'll be closed uh, Christmas Day and Tuesday and reopen on Wednesday. All right, say ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Ho, ho, ho. There you go. <laughs> Come see him, Don Rains and his family at Don's Meat Shop in Hickson. Phone number and website there on your screen. And listen, he's still chuckling just like Santa. <laughs> Visit Colony 13.